Okay, so there's two bolts on either side and um, and then this piece was in the back and it kind of locks into place. You just kind of wiggle it, get it back in there and then it like locks into place. Um, but what's concerning is that this tab right here, there's a third screw here, which I wish I would have taken off first. I don't think I broke it, but it's broken right there. Um, so this plastic, and it looks like there's even, you know, I thought there was a tab or something there. I'll look at the diagram and make sure it's not missing a tab between this and there, but I'm gonna just JB weld it because I don't think you can really see it while it's on all on the bike, but like solid, make it solid so it doesn't break more. So you can see that there's like a, almost like a weird zip tire plastic that holds the brake cable and the speedometer. Um, so I can't really pull it off. I can't, maybe there's some kind of a release over here. All right, so it actually just slides forward. I don't know if you can get it, I can feel it, but it's like an open bracket right there. So, I don't know if it's quite directional, but turning it definitely helped. Okay, so and there you go. Just comes out right there. This is the box that front brake comes into the rear, well, the front, the cable to the front brake and the rear brake come in here and there's some kind of balancing circuit uh, to even out the brakes um, when you pull one, both pulled, whatever, I forget exactly. Um, but we're going to delete that and we're just going to run a regular cable from the handlebars straight down to the tire. Not sure where we were last time, but this is was bolted onto there. Okay, so there's this bolt that's attached to the bracket, this bolt through here, kind of hard to get, um, and then there's a bolt here to get that off. I don't think I need to take that off, I just need to get those two off. I didn't see that one at first, um, and then I can remove. This weird contraption that it, it's like a brake balancer. Um, kind of got jacked up, so I can't really do it, or can I? So the rear brake just kind of pulls on the rear brake. Wait. It, I don't get it. It's weird. Um, so yeah, so I'm going to take that off. I'm going to remove these from the handlebar and then put ruckus length cables here for the front and for the rear.